The last guard is our five guard. Now, if you're gonna use this, the teeth are extremely wide in between. I rarely ever use this, but I do use it. You have to be a little bit more careful because you've got your guard exposed more, so it's easy to grab a, say, a mat and pull it right in and cut skin because the guard itself is so spaced between. I'm not gonna use this right now, it's so short. I could maybe do a, a, a demo cut here on his foot in the back so that I can hide it like I told you guys earlier. So you're taking off a little bit more than the four. But you'll be able to do all this, this whole foot. You see, and then we're gonna trim all that around, right? So I don't want to use that on his body. I don't want to go through with the five guard on his body. But I, I have to show you for the video's sake, because this is a five guard, this is a guard. So here I'll come down and show you. It's gonna take off like that much more. Now I can get away with just leaving that, right? And not being, once you wash and dry, it'll pop a little bit more. But you can see that is really short. Just before going into what we might, I'm not probably gonna do it, but seven blade, right? So your seven blade and then your 10 blade for summer cuts. So your five guard, I forgot to mention it, is a one eighth inch, leaving the hair on the body one eighth inch long. Again, we won't do it on the face right now because I do want to leave his muzzle. May chisel out his eyes a bit more and come back and chisel out the top of his eyebrow. 